now we are hitting company number two in terms of our reviews. This is Lava, a company that finally seems to be doing very well in the Indian smartphone market. Great momentum behind them, good sales, and they've got some serious numbers now. And one phone that may help them, at least that's what they think, may help them is this one, the Lava Iris 504 Cube. Now, about 12, 13,000 rupees, pretty interesting specs. We're going to take a quick look at the Selguru review. Lava once again tries to bring in some volcanic heat into the smartphone market by bringing in the all-new Iris 504 Q. This is a 5-inch phone that treats the borders of the phablet category. Though at 140 grams and with a waistline of 8.4 millimeters, it is easy to hold. It has an IPS display with a 1280 by 720 HD resolution. It's packed in a black plastic casing but unfortunately doesn't have any design cues or accents to elevate it to a more premium segment. There is an 8-megapixel camera at the back with LED flash. The picture quality is pretty good and even low-light photography impressed us. There are several settings such as HDR, panorama, various scene modes and even a multi-angle mode. It can record HD videos at 1080p. The secondary camera is 2 megapixel. The Iris 504Q also packs in gesture control, so you can swipe across photographs without even touching your phone which may seem more gimmicky than useful to most people. After all, how many of us are really using these kind of features after the euphoria of the first few days? It runs on the Android 4.2 Jelly Bean operating system and will get over-the-air software upgrades. It has a 1.2 GHz quad-core processor with a RAM of 1 GB and it supports a microSD card up to 32 GB. Though this seems adequate, there were instances when we felt the phone seemed to lag. But maybe it was our review unit acting up. An interesting accessory with the phone is the intelligent flip cover that turns the display off when flipped onto the screen. There is a 2000mAh battery which the company claims would give you over 11 hours of talk time. Our mileage on that was a tad lower. The dual SIM phone is priced at 13,000 rupees. All in all, this phone from Lava seems to tick off all that is needed in this segment. And for a phone at this price of about 13,000, this one will deliver most of what you want from a smartphone.